Hello, we are Ukrainians, and we kept calm for 22 years. We kept calm with corrupted government. We kept calm when ex-Prime Minister Yulia Tymoshenko was imprisoned. We kept calm when Alexander Popov took his son to school and was captured by the police, and after tortures was accused of murder of person he had never met. In 2013, Amnesty International held annual marathon, Right for Rights, to support people whose rights were violated. Capital of Ukraine, Kiev, November 25th. Masked police gunmen storm into a movie theater, and he encountered the audience a young man and a lawyer who allowed himself to ask policemen what were the reasons of the arrest. The video of this brutal kidnapping in one day exploded social networks of political parties, caused hard discussions in Council of Lawyers of Ukraine. Lawyers and activists didn't keep calm anymore. They wanted to know, was it for real? Did the police have right to ignore all laws and procedures? What could community do? Then, we revealed that the performance had been staged, but people had already exchanged information and discussed how civil society and lawyers should act to prevent illegal arrests. Incredibly, our social experiment turned out to be prophetic. In five days, Ukrainian government tried to repress peaceful protests and started illegal arrests indeed. Thanks God, hundreds of lawyers and activists already knew what to do and were ready to act. They had at least five days to think and prepare. Ukrainians do not keep calm anymore. Our voices are heard all over the world. These are voices for human rights and freedom. We also collected more letters for the marathon this year.